and the law of your head okay may ask you may recommend you to counsel however the law of your head may also defend you specifically to counsel so they go to the invisible world to meet with the law okay so they, they don't just see the law they don't just feel the law they don't see the law in possession like um someone who is possessed with the law no they see the laws face to face okay <laughs> Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about why you need to levitate and why you need to cancel. Those two things are not the same thing because people tend to believe like they are the same thing but they are not. In this video, we're going to talk about the definition of those two things, the definition of levitate and cancel. So before we go further into the video, I would like to thank all of my subscribers. Always like my videos, always leave comments, okay? And to those who haven't yet, what are you waiting for okay so if you like what i'm doing if you're into what i'm doing it's a way of supporting me okay so that i can continue uh, uploading videos okay so first of all we're gonna talk about lavitate it's gonna be very simple we're gonna be very brief about it so lavitate is kind of similar to kanzo but they are both very very different from each other if you're one of those people that and you feel like nothing works out right for you okay you feel like you're cursed so you're feeling like you are having a lot of troubles okay everything you touch crumbles down okay you're feeling like you're in need of a miracle you're feeling like uh, the Lord you're trying to tell you something then I will recommend you to do a lavitate okay because it's a way like to do a deep reconnection with the Lord to get your life back together because you are in need of a miracle in your life so this process may take up to three days, okay? In those three days, you are cut from the world, okay? So you're basically not using any technology because you're inside the peristyle or inside the javel. So you cut all contact with the outside, okay? So that you can make things work towards your miracle. So you can do a lavitate as many times as you want in your lifetime, okay? So if any of you know any information about lavitate, feel free to tell me that down below in the comment section okay now let's talk about cancel okay so what is cancel why you need to cancel cancel is basically an initiation into voodoo but first of all let me make things clear okay not all voodooists are cancel um they call people who are cancel on see cancel so not all voodooists are on see cancel so it's not really an obligation so voodoo is a very tolerant religion or spirituality as many people most people prefer to say so a lot of things in voodoo are not obligation so what is interesting about kanzo then so the thing is when you are on sikanzo you know more about dolwa okay so you have like a stronger relationship with dolwa so you know more about the rituals okay you know how to do rituals properly okay how to do like offerings properly to the law and the law of your head okay may ask you may recommend you to cancel among the Lwa were known to ask people to cancel or Papa Ogu, Ezili Danto, and sometimes Ezili Freda. However, the Lwa of your head may also defend you specifically to cancel. So one thing we need to know about the Lwa is that they are very personal depending on who's serving the Lwa. Okay, so what your Lwa may ask you to do, even if I'm serving the same Lwa, she may ask me to do something completely different. Okay, she may defend me to do some type of things, but she lets you do it. Okay, so so our relationship with the law they are very personal okay we need to bear that in mind so if the law of your head defends you to counsel but you do it regardless so 
you need to prepare to pay the consequences okay so the law of your head they are like your angel okay they are like your uh, protective angel so they see ahead of you they know what's good for you okay so they defend you to cause or they have a reason for that so you better not go against their words and Dambala is well known as a law who doesn't ask people to counsel. It's not like he defends you, okay, to counsel. No, he just doesn't really ask you to do it or not. Because he is a very powerful law, okay? He is the head of the Jevo. Jevo is the house of the law, okay? So he's like the law of everybody already. That's why he doesn't really ask people to counsel or not. So if you are someone that Dambala specifically asks you to counsel or you know someone that Dambala asks to counsel, let me know that down below in the comment section, okay? When you are in the counsel process, it may take up to two weeks, okay? Between those two weeks, you are like cut from the world. So it means no telephone, no technology, okay? No anything at all to get into contact with the outside. So they train you, they teach you a lot of things about the Loire, okay, about the voodoo, about how to do rituals, offerings, all of that, okay? So they do a lot of magical experiences with you. But the most important thing is they present you to the Loire, okay? So they establish like a greater um, connection with the Loire okay so, and most people that i know that are counsel they say that you know they they saw the law face to face so they, they don't just see the law they don't just feel the law okay they don't see the law in possession like um someone who is possessed with the law no they see the laws face to face okay so they go to the invisible world to meet with the law okay but to experience this you have to reach like the highest level in the initiation okay so there are three levels in council okay so there are council sep there are council supoi and there are council asongwe okay and people who are council they call them onsi council okay so there are onsi council sep onsi council supoi and onsi council so to reach the highest level in council, Baba Loco is the one that you need the approval from. So this is it guys, this is the video, thank you so much for watching. So feel free to ask me any questions, to tell me your opinions, okay, in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet, and like the video. And the most important thing is to click the notification button, so that YouTube may notify you whenever I upload a new video. Stay safe and see you in another video. Oh,